All right, the goal of this video is to show you how to create congruent angles. I want to first of all start you out by recognizing that this angle is about 52 degrees. Our goal now is to create another angle that's also 52 degrees. Next, uh, if you're going to start to create a, a new angle, we've got to start with a side and build a ray off of point Y. We'll start with that first. So take your, comp or your straight edge and draw a straight line off of point Y. Make it sure it's longer than this side right here. And the next thing we want to do is we want to do this strategy right here. We want to create congruent circles and then also measure the arc length that's within that circle about how wide that angle is. So first of all, take your sharp edge and let's create the circle around uh, point X. What we're going to do is we're going to create this exact same circle around point Y. So there you see that one. Let's do the exact same thing here for point Y. So if I do that here, I also get a circle. And my sharp tip was not perfect on that black dot, but hopefully it, it was close enough to make this all work. Next, I want to then measure how wide is this opening. So we want to take our compass now and use a sharp point on this dot and then measure how wide it is over to here. That way we can measure how wide is this arc. That's the, the second step of this process. So we take our compass and we want to set it to the measurement by putting a sharp edge on this place right here and then to this place right here. And make sure your pencil is perfectly at the both of those points. Now I've got the measurement of that, that uh, arc laid out, and I can show you what it looks like here if I put it this way also. It doesn't, shouldn't matter which way I go. This should go through, oops, a little, it just moved a little bit, uh, to get it to go through that point of the arc where it hits the side of that angle. Now I could do a whole circle if you want, just to keep it a little bit more simple. That way you can see it, kind of how it all gets created here. And I'll do the same thing now on the other point uh, that we're, of where this crosses the congruent circle also. We'll draw that exact same circle over here. Now, where this compass measurement is right here, crossing the original congruent circle that we made, that will then tell you how wide to make your angle. So this point right here over to this point right here will be the exact same size opening as the original one here on angle X. Take your straight edge now, and hopefully we're going to make another 52 degree angle with these new crossings. And Let's take our protractor and just verify that we are great people, great mathematicians with our uh, compasses here. Let's see if we can get this to work. And sure enough, as you can see, that angle also is 52 degrees. Hopefully this video helps in creating congruent angles like you saw in this video, and good luck.